Hi, my name is Vito Belfort and now we're going to go forth for the leg locks and foot lock techniques. You can use in Jiu Jitsu sport and NHB fighting. And this is my assistant, Rodrigo Medeiros. We're going to be showing you guys a lot of secrets, a lot of different ways, different types of foot locks and leg locks. Enjoy yourself. Okay guys, let's start in the closing guard, okay? The guy gets you in the guard, okay, from here. What we're gonna do here, we're gonna get one part of the gi, we're gonna try to choke him over here. Okay, but we're not gonna just gonna choke. You just fake the same the same place you're choking here, you know, if I choke with my right, I'm gonna lift up my right my right leg and here at the same time I'm gonna sweep this leg, I'm gonna swing around his neck. Here I'm gonna do this and I'm gonna go that way. Okay, as soon as I go, I'm gonna catch the leg. Then I have the foot lock over here. Okay, hold your wrist, make sure you have the chin and pressure. Okay guys, watch the details now, you know, from this angle, you're gonna be able to see. I'm gonna fake the choke and I'm gonna go for the leg lock, okay? Okay, if I, I get his, his collar, with my left arm, I'm going to choke him right here, okay? And at the same time, I'm going to stand, lift my opposite leg, okay? And then I'm going to bring this leg, swing around his neck. I'm here, and then I go. Go for the foot lock, okay? Sit on him, make sure you have your, holding your wrist and your pressure. Okay guys, now sometimes you get in a standing position over here, the guy have the hooks, okay, he, he's hooking your biceps, okay, and then what I'm gonna do from here, first, this, this leg over here, I'm gonna swing this leg to my other arm, here, boom, put under my arm, okay, I'm here, fighting, okay, I take this hook away and this this feet is in my biceps. I'm gonna put under this arm. I put under the arm, I hold my wrist, I'm gonna sit down to my opposite side. If his foot on my under my left arm, I sit, I go towards my right side. And from here, you know, we have the foot lock. Okay? Okay guys, make sure when you bring his leg under your, your opposite arm, you know, make sure you lock very, very important to lock your elbow and you're gonna jump to your opposite way, okay? I'm gonna shoot. I'm here, he's fine with me here, he have his hooking my right arm, okay? My right arm, I'm gonna hold his gi and I'm gonna take this hook away and make sure my knee is blocking this leg, you see? He cannot hook over here anymore. Just over here, under my hand, no problem. I'm gonna bring these legs towards my opposite arm. Hold my wrist, hold the pants, and I'm gonna jump, sit to my opposite way. Make sure this leg go over here. Okay, make sure he trying to come, he don't let him come, see? And you press here, here. No problem. Okay guys, sometimes happen when you get the foot lock over here, 
you know, the guy turn his knee to that side. Okay, what I'm gonna do from here, I'm gonna change here. I'm gonna hold his ankle over here. You see, I'm here. He turn, same time he turn, I change and you know, and I make sure your knee's tight, okay? But when he trying to roll, you know, you don't have time. You just hold your hands and make sure you go very slow in this move because your guy can get hurt, okay? Just the ACL. Make sure you don't go hard in your friend. Make sure you go, you know, and let it go. Okay, guys, you're here holding his feet, you know, and sometimes the guy turn and you know just he put his foot away and now you cannot get his foot anymore. You know sometimes the guy push you know and you can get get the feet but you go for the ankle lock here. You here you slide your arm make sure you have his ankle here you see you have his ankle hold here make sure when you hold just press you know it's an ankle lock you can get the ACL ligaments, okay? Okay guys, you here, sometimes doesn't work the foot lock and not the ankle lock. The guy turns and you're gonna miss. As soon as you miss the position, make sure this leg over here kicks inside and you lock and you have the leg lock here okay okay guys sometimes you get his leg and now all of a sudden he turns you just kick your leg you see and pull his leg and you're gonna have the leg lock okay when you hold his leg and you know you cross your legs over one leg make sure your knees tight and the power is just like armbar. You pull his leg down, your hip bring up, makes pressure on his bone, you know, on his capsule of his knee and make it quit. Okay? Let's go fast now. Okay guys, we learned how to cross over and get the leg here, but now we're gonna learn, you here, the guy put the, hand, the foot over here in the hip, okay, you're gonna put, you're gonna put your arm under his, his ankle and you're gonna just put under your hip, your, your arm, quick, you see, you do this, quick, one move, one, and the other one, take, take it out, you're gonna sit, the same thing, put your legs over here and you're gonna have the foot dog over here. Make sure you hold your wrist and the other one hold the chin and make sure you press on your hip, okay? Okay guys, from this angle, you see when I put his feet under my armpit and the other arm, you're gonna just snap out, okay? His feet, okay? I'm here, same time, see? Boom, and now, this knee gonna go between his leg and this leg gonna go over you know pressing the hip the, the knees together to make pressure you know hold my wrist hold his chin you know pressure a lot of pressure here it's very important elbows together and bring your hips up okay <laughs> Okay guys, 
you're gonna be end up over here in this position. Sometimes you hear the guy turns that way. Okay, now I turn. You see, I let I leave his fingers, his toes under my armpit, and I make sure I have his ankle, and I pressure, and I have the ankle lock from that position. It's a different type of angle ankle lock, okay? Okay guys, from this angle, you watch, I'm here in the foot lock, he turns that way. This, um, go over here, this leg go over here, you know, this, let his toes under my armpits, make sure I have his ankle, and I press, see, I turn, pressing my knee together, very important, your knees gotta be close, tight, and and you have the ankle. Okay? Okay guys, on this angle you're gonna see the time he turns is very important. I pass over this leg and I make sure I have my knees very tight. Now he's all locked up. And I'm gonna have his toes under my armpit. And I'm gonna have his ankle, you know, very pressure on your elbow. Make sure your elbow's tight. Okay, with your back and bring his ankle towards you and you make him tap. Simple. Here. Okay guys, from this position, we can go for a bunch of different leg locks and foot locks, okay? I'm here, I'm getting the, the foot, he's very flexible, he don't tap on his feet, okay? And now sometimes the guy trying to push you here, okay? What I'm gonna do, the time he push me, I'm gonna bring his leg, I'm gonna close the both knees, you see? I have now his both legs. And I'm gonna go for this ankle lock over here. I have his foot over here and I have his ankle right here, okay? You can choose what you want. If you want this, you go to this. If you want his feet, you go, okay? You choose what you want, okay? A bunch of different ways to get it. Okay guys, this happens a lot in Jiu Jitsu. Sometimes you end up on this position, you know? The guy's trying to push you here, and you know, and you don't know what to do. You cannot catch, you know, he catch you here. You cannot go and try to finish this leg. No problem. You hold his leg, pull this, go around, and you know, you make sure you have his legs now. You see, I press with my both knees, make pressure that I have his both legs now. I can go either that way, or I can turn either. I can turn that way and go to this over here, you know, this ankle, doesn't matter. But, if you're here, you still have his feet on that leg and you have the ankle on that leg, okay? If you go to the ankle lock, make sure you hold your other hand and you have that. If you go to the foot lock, put under his feet under your arm pitch, hold your wrist, Make sure, you know, you put pressure on your hip and you'll be fine. Okay guys, now you're in the guard. We learn a bunch of different ways to catch the leg when you're on the top. Now let's learn when you're on the bottom, okay? I'm here doing guard and now I'm gonna hold crossing. If I'm gonna take my left leg under his leg, I hold my right arm, you know, his arm, 
Okay? This I hold the feet. Now I'm gonna swing my leg around and here and the other one. You're just gonna push. You see you can hook or you can push and here you have the ankle. Okay, make sure you have this hook is better. Here you finish. Okay, why I have this hook over here? If I don't have this hook over here, he will turn and you know and I miss the position. Okay? Okay, from this angle guys, you're gonna pay attention to the details. It's very important. The same time I pull this arm, this leg go under. As soon as I put this leg over, this leg go hook over here. You know, make sure you're on his tight and here you have his ankle and you press and you'll be fine. Okay? You gotta have this hook under his legs. If you don't, doesn't work. Okay guys, now what we're gonna learn we're gonna have this this leg here and sometimes we cannot go we cannot pull his arm he's strong okay no problem you're gonna hook this leg over here and you're gonna push him as soon as you push him you're gonna fall down and you're gonna have this leg okay when you have this leg go towards the way of the foot and then this leg gonna pass over here and we have the foot lock over here okay Make sure you have the pressure. Here, you're fine. Okay guys, you can see the details. I'm not using my, my hands to hold his hands. I make sure I have his feet. I put my feet on his hip. Here, I hook. And I'm gonna push and I bring this to me and I push with my, my feet on his hip gonna push. And my other feet under his leg gonna pull towards me. Okay, here, boom, and then I have, and I go to the foot lock. Here, done deal. Okay guys, sometimes you're trying to mount him and he got his feet here, I cannot mount, okay? I'm gonna do, I'm gonna bring, hold my arm, bring towards me over here. As soon as I bring, I'm gonna hold his feet and here, I have my foot lock, okay? Again, one more time, I'm here, I'm trying to mount him, you know, but instead of going to the mountain, I'm gonna bring him towards me over here, see? Now, Rodrigo gonna try to bring his leg back, he can't. See, I lock it up. Hold over here, hold my feet, and I have the foot lock, okay? It's very simple, make sure you grab your wrist. And you see, here you twist, okay? It's very simple, but it's very effective. Okay guys, sometimes you get in this guard position, happen a lot of times on tournaments on Jiu Jitsu, you know. And what you're gonna have, the guy's gonna have your hand over here, what you're gonna do, you're gonna take this gripper away. As soon as you take this away, now I'm gonna catch this feet, okay. As you can see, I'm gonna leave, if his, I'm gonna take his left leg, my left leg, gonna. I'm gonna bring my left leg up. Okay, as soon as I bring it up, I'm gonna just sit down 
you know, here, I'm gonna have this ankle. Okay, make sure when you sit down, you see, oh, I'm here, I'm gonna sit down over here, bring it up, you know, when I sit down, I bring this leg here, boom, where I can have, you know, he cannot turn anymore. Now, I have this ankle here, very easy to get. Very dangerous, go very slow, you can hurt your partner, okay? These are ECL ligaments. Make sure you go very slow. Okay guys, this is a very common position in Jiu-Jitsu tournament, okay? You here, you end up here, okay? First thing, I gotta take this grip away. As soon as I'm gonna do this, I done this, you know, I'm gonna take his left leg, my left leg, I'm gonna bring it up. Now, I have his feet towards me, you see? And then, this leg, I bring fast, you know, boom. I lock it up, and then, I have the ankle lock, okay? Make sure you grab your hand, and have the ankle lock, okay? Okay guys, some guys they have the half guard, you know, and they put this, this happen a lot in Jiu Jitsu, you know. What I'm gonna do here, I'm gonna lift this leg up, cross here, and go leg lock, okay? Okay guys, I'm the half guard, and this happen a lot in Jiu Jitsu tournaments, okay? I hold his knee, I bring, my left leg up, you know, I'm gonna take his left leg, my left leg, I'm gonna swing around, okay, his whole body, look, here, and then I'm gonna sit on him, I make sure I sit on him, and I slide my, you see, I'm the knee, I slide to the ankle, and then I sit, crossing my feet, knees very tight, make sure you have, you bring your hip up and you have the leg lock. Okay guys, sometimes, some guys, they're very strong legs, it's hard to go, you know, they're very strong, they try to bring here. When they bring the leg, before they bring the legs down, you see, here, they have strong leg, they're gonna do this, you're gonna hold here, and go to the foot lock, from here, okay? I'm here, having the, foot, the leg lock, the guy is strong, he's bringing his leg down, stop, hold his feet, and don't use the strength, just turn, and you have the whole foot lock working, okay? Okay guys, some guys, they don't have strength to go that way, but they twist, trying to go that way, escaping the hip. You know, I hook, make sure you hook, and now I'm gonna do the American lock opposite way. I hold here, put this under, hold my, hold my wrist, and go American lock opposite way. Okay, one more time. I have the leg, he escaped. Okay, he moves. Boom. Now I hold his feet. The other one, my arms go under. You see his leg. Hold my wrist. Make sure I press opposite way here and I have the foot lock, okay? This foot lock works, you know, they, go, uh, they work with the ligaments in the bones, okay? Make sure you press very slow, very smooth, you don't wanna hurt your friend, 
You don't want to hurt nobody else. Okay, guys, sometimes this move that I'm going to show you now, you know, I'm, I showed you before without the gi. Now I'm showing you with the sport gi, you know. A lot of guys, they can't, they, they just can't put one hook inside the other guy blocking the other hook, you know, you have one hook inside and you cannot put this hook here, he's blocking, okay, no problem. I'm gonna make sure, you know, I have this hook over here, see, my feet hooking right here. I don't wanna see here, I wanna see your hook right inside here, your feet hooking his feet, okay. You here, okay, I'm gonna turn Grab his feet towards me, close the triangle, and pressure. And I have the foot lock, knee lock, muscle lock, everything, you know what I mean? Okay guys, remember, Jiu Jitsu is not about strength, it's about technique and leveraging power. Okay? You have your hook, you cannot put this hook here. Okay, he's blocking your hook over here with his hand. You cannot put your hook, no problem. He just turn, hold his feet, bring towards you, make sure you're holding his hip over here. See, with my, my elbow. Close the guard, I bring it up to me, and it's perfect. Okay guys, this one, we're gonna be end up in the same technique we learned before, but in a different way. He's gonna have his hook over here, I'm just gonna turn, you see, if he hook on my right, I'm gonna turn that way, and I'm gonna sit on him and have the leg lock, okay, boom. Okay guys, this don't use strength, it's just speed, I'm here. I'm gonna just turn, see how I turn. But we gotta complete the turn. You turn and you sit. Oh. I turn and sit. And then I have the whole leg. I close my my legs and I have the leg lock. Here. Okay? Okay guys, I hope you enjoyed the tapes and make sure you don't forget to be a complete fighter. You gotta learn strikes, takedowns, guard, wrestling, Jiu Jitsu, you gotta learn it all. And I hope with my background, I help you guys to be a world champion one day. Okay, see you soon. Take care, God bless you.